Hello and welcome to a new unboxing video. I'm Fet, and today we're going to take a look at Ninu Kuni 2 Revenant Kingdom, the King Edition. For PC, uh, there's nothing different other than this here is a digital download, so there's a code inside so I can download it, probably a Steam code if I remember correctly. And everything else is pretty much the same. So I got this here, yeah, I got this here from GameStop, sadly. And you can see this here has some awesome art on it. And we are going to look at, we are going to get a soundtrack, uh, some disc, actually, uh, I think it's a Blu-ray or some kind of making of, or exclusive making of, yeah. We have a uh, season pass. We have all the shebang here. Uh, system requirements down here is uh, not something it could pretty much run on a potato, pretty much. GTX 750 Ti, AMD Radeon R7, you need around 40 gigabytes of free space and DirectX 11 and Windows 7. That's the minimum requirements. We have about 8 gigs of RAM, 4 gigs of RAM is minimum, 6, 8 gigs of RAM is Mac is recommended. Uh, 970 R9. And I think it's, uh, yeah, still Windows 7 Service Pack 1 or Windows 8.1. Go Windows 10 if you can. And that's for 1080, 60 frames per second. So, I have not played this here yet, but I have just uncovered this here. So we're going to do this. And there we go. So we have this here, nice box here. And that's just the outer shell. And then we slide this sucker up. And I have not played the first one. And I do not want to go back. And people say you don't need to. Oh, that's some beautiful art there. Um, you can definitely see this here is a Ghibli studio. So now we have the sound of of, ten, of Nino Kuni 2, the Revenant Kingdom, and this here is oh 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 guys oh oh shit oh oh shit that is oh these here are LPs vinyls so this here is the vinyl edition. Uh, yeah, we're going to take a look at that in just a minute. I'm just going to put that in, but wow. Wow. Like, I, go to, go to, go to my Instagram. I'll take pictures of this here. Jesus. Oh, Christ, that is awesome. Okay, so that's the sound off. We have uh, the art. Please don't fall down and make noise. We have the art here, and there is like... A nice little that's a hefty art book we're going to take a look at that in just a sec holy crap there's a lot here uh let me see here i probably need to sit down i thought i could stand up doing this here but no no i can't so that's that okay so we have Okay, I need I need to actually remember how actually this here is set up. So we have the game right here. We have the game here, which is a uh, Steam download code only, no disc included. So yeah, we have the hardcover, which is beautiful. And this here is of course the Blu-ray making off. You have some codes here, season pass, and all that in here. We're going to take a look at that in just a sec here. Now we're going to have to get this here sucker up somehow. I do not know how, but let's see if we can do it like here. And that's that. And I do not think there's anything else in it. We're double checking. I have seen other stuff. But I do think we're actually clear here. So let us put that away. Sorry about that. Okay. So this here is statue slash like a, we're trying to pristine it of some kind here. And again, a beautiful art. 
just going around telling the story and there we have it let's see if i can get this here out there we go there we go it is plastic but it is definitely beautiful plastic so First off, I'm going to put this here back in. So we're going to keep this here pristine. So let's take a better look at it, actually, if we can. So, uh, this here is actually a wind-up. At the bottom here, there's a wind-up. And it actually sounds pretty good. So, holy crap. Beautiful. That's actually something, wow. Uh, sadly, it does stick up because it is a, like an adhesive. It's going to, I'm just going to try and, it does get fingerprints all over it. Um, sadly, but as you can see right here, we have, I do not know the character's name, but I think this here is the main character, sort of protagonist here, main protagonist we have, uh, yeah, she's here, uh, yeah, but again, you wind up and uh, it plays, holy, holy cow, that's beautiful, and you see these here, cat ears and everything like, and Siri, and Siri really likes to uh, listen to what I'm saying right now, even though I'm not saying her name, but yeah. Awesome. Awesome. So let's take a look at the other things. So try not to drag this here on too long. So, okay, Blu-ray. Let us zoom in and focus if I can. There we go. So we have a nice art style of her sitting on the throne, which is the picture of this here pretty much. Um, and we have a crest on the back. We have the Roman King. Let me actually try and get this here. I'm making noise constantly. And yeah, and it is like the art, the style of it all, uh, you can't, get any better. We have again the art style around um, the print on uh, on the Blu-ray, the making of. We have some store Bandai, Namco EU stuff because this here is a European one. There is the 1500 points registration in here so I'm not going to show you that but that's a code for that. We have postcards I think. Postcards. And then we have for, that should have probably been for the game, but since it is download only, it's not a part of it. So let's take a look at this here. here. So we have, and let's see, can get the glare out of it. So we have, of course, that one. We have a postcard of the print of, uh, of, the, of the whole group going around. And we have, uh, which is, they're looking over her or, or the protagonist and uh, her companion looking over the kingdom and uh, you see a dragonfly over it. Beautiful. Beautiful. I can't wait to play this here. I've here, seen great reviews of it. So, yeah. So we are going to put that right back. I think, yep, here. Okay. This here is the game. Nothing special to it. Other than we're just going to try and open this here up gently. And it is steam, so that's great. I love steam. And yeah, we have steam code and season pass. 
So that's it. And there here we have in the background the kingdom, as you can see. I think it's the kingdom. And yeah, it's a, as you can see, this here is a, you need to rub it. So yeah, awesome. Okay, so I'm taking that out, taking this here. So let's look at the other stuff, right? Let's look at the other stuff. So let us take a really, really good look at this here. This here is the protagonist in a beautiful, beautiful art style. Like this here is art in its best. And we have um, the sound of the Revenant Kingdom, and it's the theme th soundtrack, or the theme on track one, track two. Uh, I do not think this here is the full soundtrack, and we've seen this here, sadly, with many uh, collector's editions, that you only get a taste, and you have to afterwards go out and actually get it. And then we have this here fold up. Um, this here fold up. Uh, a picture uh, in the middle here, which is a genius idea to actually have something in here. And then you have uh, only this here left, and that is the vinyl itself. I am a little bit sad there is no CD of it, but again, I have nothing against the vinyl, it's just that I do not have a vinyl player. So we will, as always, take a... Oh, oh, oh. Look at this, look at this. Wow. Lance, you need to get this here. And Lance, Lance in Japan, as I know, a big, great fan of mine, actually collects vinyl uh, of games. And I do know that he is probably right now envious that he didn't get it, or maybe he got it, and I will tease him if he didn't. So yeah, wow, wow, <laughs> and a crest on the back, holy crap, that's beautiful, beautiful. Sadly, again, I do not own uh, a vinyl player, but wow, if you do, this here's a treat. It's a treat to look at, I'm just not going to be using it i'm gonna to i'm going to have to say i'm probably gonna have to just store it for for remembrance of it all but yeah wow beautiful beautiful okay to the last piece of the resistance as they would say the art book hardcover this here was the meat, and, the meat of it all. We know Ghibli. We know them for great, uh, great anime movies like Princess Mononoke, Howl's, uh, Howl's Castle, uh, Howl's Moving Castle. Uh, we we know them for um, uh, Spirit Away. Uh, oh God, they've made many movies. I, I'm not a big fan of their new stuff. I'm more of the old school. I'm a big Mononoke fan. Uh, yeah, um, I actually own Mokinem Mononoke on the first print of um, of um, of DVD. So yeah, so we see this here table contents and all. It's just beautiful, and there we have it. It is pretty much, and that this here is Evan, and yeah. This here is pretty much what probably is uh, over there in the museum right now. As we can see, it is probably, you will probably see this here in a big, 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 big uh, wall over in the Ghibli Museum, which I hope f that I at some point can visit. We have Roland here. We have Tani, Lander, Batu. Bracken, Maidrows, Lofty, Chibi versions of them all. 
and all the other characters. Probably NPCs we meet, other important characters, monsters that we see. And we don't know, what, and I'm not going to spoil too much of it all because we are looking at what is in the game. I haven't played it. So that is something to look forward to when you play the game. It will look like this here. I do hope the game runs well on PC. I'm taking a leap of faith of playing it on PC. But yeah, so far I am hugely impressed with this here. The previous unboxing video, which you probably have seen, if you haven't, go check that out, was of course the Far Cry uh, Collector's Edition, which I am also really, really impressed about. Um, it is definitely worth picking up if you're a Far Cry fan. It is also worth picking up uh, just for the Collector's Edition's sake. Um, I am gonna go ahead and put things back in order. I am gonna keep this here out. And then I'm gonna put this here back. And I do think we're almost getting close to the last part of it all. And that is putting the lid back on. So, here you have it guys, it has been a pleasure unboxing this here. Great collector's edition, and I do say so myself, if this here is a game you want to pick up at some point, and you do like collector's edition stuff, this here is definitely, it is not cheap, but it's definitely something special. And with this here, you can't go wrong, right? So, thank you for watching, until next time, bye.